<laughs> hey. It's kind of, kind of, uh, Andrew Ward and Jeff McElrath. I've never, I've never. Felt, He's Andrew. I've never felt more um, egotistical walking around. <laughs> you're, not, you're not supposed to say that while we're on camera. <laughs> you're supposed to look at the camera and be funny. Uh, problem is, death, I'm not funny. <laughs> <laughs> so we're at that Ashy show in Nashville, walking around. We have our own booth, but we want to walk around and check things out. I think what's most important to hospitals and customers and their customers is the functionality, number one, but also um, the healing environment, you know, the inspiring healing environment. So number three would probably be um, cost, you know, it's budget friendly. So we want to provide a cost effective solution that's not only inviting, aesthetically pleasing to look at, but also functional in nature. But that's what matters most to us. Out of jokes, so I'm going to pass it on to David. Pass it on to Andrew. He's he got the most. Joke. <laughs> I don't have any jokes. I'm not a funny guy. <laughs> is that the joke? That's the joke. <laughs> this is a pretty bad one too. So why why should you never give Elsa a balloon? Or, no, there you go. <laughs> She'll let it go. Um, this is what came out of the lean process, is we, uh, we did things the same way that they've always been done for, for so long. And um, as we looked at the way we were doing things um, and created those, those future state maps, how we could not just reduce waste, but do things better, make it better. That's one of our core values. This was low-hanging fruit. This was, this was a product that, um, that was born out of communication and collaboration amongst our teams, not just our, our engineers, but our installers, our project managers, the people who were doing the work. We figured there's got to be a better way to do this. But we also knew that, that we needed to be able to control the inside of, of the head wall in order to be able to provide the, the cost savings and the, and the speed of construction that I think everybody in the marketplace was looking for. So prefabrication is not something that's necessarily new. We're just trying to figure out a better way to prefab. One of the things I want to make sure that I note is you know, before we before we bring any of our product in the in the patient room, it's just a blank room. It's when we install our head wall and in our casework and our millwork that builds an atmosphere and an environment in that room. And that's what that's what what one of the main reasons that uh, inspired us to do that, especially after the lean you know, going through the lean process. Not just wanting to make things better, but also how do we do it in a way that that creates a, a, a healing environment. All right, so we are here at the final day of the Ashy Show, and we're walking around. We're going to go take a look at some booze, uh, but wanted to start the day off with a few jokes. So, no so, jokes. I'm... <laughs> so why don't they play poker in the jungle? I don't know. What? Because there's cheetahs. <laughs> <laughs> cheetahs, baby.
like what do you, haters. What do you call it when Batman skips church? Oh, man. Uh, I don't know. Robin? That's good. Yeah. So Christian that's Bale. What our goal is to show what we do. <laughs> that is. That's bad. That's bad. What do you call it when you combine a caterpillar or a milla, a, 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 a centipede, and a carrot? No idea. Walkie-talkie. <laughs>